this is so crispy in the outside but super juicy in the inside all you need is just three ingredients to achieve this amazing salmon recipe do not go away hello beautiful people how is it going i trust everyone is doing so so well on today's menu we're cooking with claudie i will be bringing to you this crispy salmon but juicy in the inside recipe in the oven if you're new here a very big welcome to you to my returning subscribers you guys are always the best please if you haven't yet subscribed Please take a moment to hit the subscribe button and turn on that notification bell for the ingredients we have our salmon fillet here it's looking so beautiful for the rest of the ingredients some cajun seasoning lemon pepper my lemon pepper has salt which is just okay for me and some paprika also another ingredients um this one is optional i will be adding some italian blend or some italian seasoning i just need that extra herbs in there because the cajun seasoning has some herbs already but i just need some extra herbs inside from this italian blend but you can skip this part if you want to but if you want that extra herb heat in there then you can add it so i'm just gonna mix my seasoning half teaspoon lemon pepper one teaspoon cajun seasoning one and half teaspoon paprika and one teaspoon italian seasoning or italian blend but that is optional so i'll be telling you a very important point to achieve a good crispy salmon so rub the dry seasoning on the salmon first like really press it on there and please do not ever mix oil with the seasoning like it's not going to be crispy the trick is you have to put the seasoning on the salmon first before you now apply oil on it don't ever mix the two in a separate bowl before you apply on there they must be applied separately right now apply the oil on the salmon then you press it in so everything is well like it adheres perfectly on the salmon the oil always comes the last the seasoning first before the oil i'll just grease my foil aluminium foil here which i just lined my baking pan with and to create a barrier between my fish and the baking pan i'll just put some lemon slices there then transfer my seasoned salmon on it this is going to bake in the oven at 400 degrees fahrenheit for about 10 minutes after 10 minutes this is how it's looking then let it go back to the oven and let you grill or broil in the oven for five minutes at 400 degrees fahrenheit our salmon is perfect oh my goodness it's so flavorful so i'm just going to lift it up and transfer onto my serving plate you see that barrier between that fish and the base it's just easy for you to lift it up so now we are going to transfer onto the plate then we do the proper presentation then we get to try it and see how flaky it is going to be but trust me i know this recipe is the best i always use this recipe all the time for dinner or when i have friends over it is so so crispy in the skin but juicy inside 
I'm just going to garnish with some dry parsley right there and look at that it is so beautiful so so beautiful right now i'm just going to be using a fork then just break it like that look at that see how flaky that looks and so so flavorful savory tasty whatever you can name it so guys you just have to try this recipe and if you get to try this recipe please come back and let me know how it turned out but it is a very quick one for sure if you don't have a lot of time to make dinner you can go for this so look how juicy that is in the inside so juicy guys thank you so much for watching to this point and i appreciate all the support the comments the like the shares i really appreciate it from the depth of my heart so thank you so much for watching this video and keep trusting my recipes till we meet again in my next video bye for now and please stay safe